Hello kids, you're welcome to our revision class on quantitative. We are going to be working on addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. So we are going to start with addition. You remember, I said that when you are adding numbers, the easiest way to add your numbers when you have two digit numbers is to add them under tens and units. So we have 11 and 49. So what you do is to write your tens units, then you write the first number 11, you put it down, the other one 49 you write it down put your addition sign then cross then we are going to add 10 plus 1 1 plus 9 will give you 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 we we'll count them together 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 we we'll have 10 we cannot write two numbers here, two digit number. So instead, we can put it here. This is unit and this is tens. You put the unit under units, then you carry this tens, the one, up here. Now we are going to add this number again. We have one plus one plus four. We are going to count now. Here you have one plus one plus four one two three four now we count everything together one two three four five and six so our answer here is six the answer is 60 you come here and put your 60 then we'll go to the next one the next one is subtraction we have two numbers again remember when you are arranging your numbers when you are working on subtraction the biggest number comes first the biggest number here is 19 so we write our tens unit you write your 90 first and you write your 27 two seven cross it minus so 7 take away, 0 take away 7 is not possible. So what we are going to do is to borrow. So we'll borrow 1 from here. You cancel this and write the remaining 8. So the 1 you borrowed here, you put it here. And it will be 10 take away 7. So we are going to count 10 and take away 7. Then you come here, you count 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. You take away 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Cancel. And what do we have left? 1, 2, 3. We have 3 left. So you write your 3 here. So the new number here is 8. So we are going to count 8, take away 2. Now let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And you take away 2. 1, 2. Cancel. What do we have left? Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We have 6 left. You write down your 6. Now, this is how we work on subtraction. So now let's go to multiplication. Now, when you are multiplying number. If you have two numbers like this, 3 times 2, this means count 3 in two places and you will get your answer. Now, let's work on it. 3 times 2 is count 3 in two places. 1, 2, 3. 1 place. 1, 2, 3 two places so now we are going to count this together to get our answer one two three four five six so three times
times 2 is 6. Now we are going to work on division. So when we are dividing numbers, hmm, we are going to be sharing them. The first thing you identify is to identify the small number there. The small number there is 3. So it means we are going to be sharing 9 by 3 persons. So now, let's assume we have 9 oranges and we have 3 persons to share those 9 oranges. So we are going to draw the head of these 3 persons. One, two, three. That is this theory. So now we are going to count this nine under this three persons to know the number each person is going to take. Now let's count nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So one person is taking three oranges so it means nine divided by three is three so this is how we work on addition subtraction multiplication and division so kids good luck on your assignments